Hey guys, it's me again. Sorry I haven't been making a whole lot of updates lately. I've still had a lot of tests and projects, but now finally pretty much done with all of those. So first, as you may notice, I finally got my braces off today. Feels great. It's a little weird though. My teeth are like really smooth and I'm not used to that. But I'm really happy about that. Still not much has been going on. I'm still working on ideas for this set. I went back to my basic one and I'm going to build stuff around it. Um... And I know a lot of you are really excited for uh, the first contact. It's just been taking a while because I have tons of you guys, which is a good thing. I'm wanting to be voice actors, storyboard writers, advertisers. It's a lot of you guys, so I'm trying to manage all that and get back to everybody. Then I, I can actually start working on this. I'm planning on getting the majority, if not all, of the first episode done this weekend. So uh, it could be technically out by... The first episode could be out by uh, next week, hopefully, in the best scenario. And a lot of you have been wanting me to do an army video for Human and my UNSC and Covenant. So on Friday I'll have that out for you guys. I'll put that out. It just takes a while because I have all my minifigures under there. All these vehicles and then there's still lots more vehicles under here. Let me show that to you. Let me grab this light. Turn that light on. As you can see, there's still a lot of stuff under here. That white thing has my minifigures, and I got all these. I got all these. It's quite a lot of stuff. But um, I'll get that out for you guys on Friday. I'm going to do it separately, two videos. One for UNSC, then one for Covenant. Majority being because I can't fit everything on this table. And I do have a lot more UNSC vehicles than I do Covenant. I still have more in my other room. But I do have some Covenants, just not a whole lot. I'm, like I said, mostly just to have UNSC stuff. And, I will be getting more of the Series 4 packs as soon as I can. And, uh, I will, I am still looking for the new Battlescape and the new sets. So if you know where those are, just tell me below. I know they're on Toy Wiz, but they're on pre-order. So if anyone knows where to get them, like, in a store where they actually have them, then please leave that in the message below. And, um, what was I going to say? Oh yeah, there's these new Mega Bloks things coming out. Which is weird, because you don't build them. I don't get how that works, you don't build them. They're kind of like die-cast figures. They, um... You don't build them. They're kind of like action figures, just the little guys don't move. They're like, really small. But there's vehicles and stuff, and they have like, firing functions or something. There's a video on it on YouTube. Um, if you want, I can post a link in the description or something. It's an interesting idea. Kind of weird, though. I mean... A lot of us really want these big ones, cause like they have falcons and stuff, and the falcons like no bigger than this. Then there's like really small little warthogs and stuff, and it's just I don't get it. I found that I found that really really weird. I don't get why they'd want to do that, but whatever. It, I'll, I'll see what happens when they come out, and I'll probably buy a couple of new them and see what you guys think and what I think. Cool idea, but I I I, I just find that kind of weird to do. I mean. It's Mega Bloks, yet you don't build it, so why are they called Mega Bloks? One of those weird things that we'll never know. But, there are a lot of you who are wondering why I have a broken Hornet just sitting here. It's a set piece, and that's the first Hornet. I obviously have the better version from Target. This one was an old one, very first wave. It's kind of breaking apart, so I thought I might as well use it as a set piece, so I'm using that. And a lot of you have a bunch of good ideas for me, so I'm using those. And um, if you guys are seriously legitimate good voice actors, I've gotten some people who say they're good voice actors, but they aren't. Whoops, that's not out. Who aren't, they aren't very good. No offense. I mean, they're good, but they're not capturing the kind of thing that I need. So if you really are good, and you can kind of act serious, because I've had some people who, what I mean by bad is like, they can't do it seriously. It's kind of like a weird jokingly voice, so that's not what I'm looking for. I mean, I could still use some of those, but just not here. I could use those for grunts or something. But if you're seriously a legitimate voice actor, and you really are interested in voice acting for my style motion, just send me a message telling me uh, why, and then I'll give me your email or something. I'll, I'll figure it out. And uh, I'll send you a script with a little, couple lines, and you can send me a demo, and I'll see how that goes. And uh, then you can tell me what kind of part you want. I'll give you a list of the parts. There's big parts, small parts, really big parts, really small parts, and all in between. So whichever one you want, I can give to you. I'm, I'm I am myself in doing a couple. 
but there's still a lot of big ones because I obviously can't be the voice of eight squad members all at once. That's not going to work. And a lot of you guys have been suggesting that you want me to do a contest of sorts. So I'll probably do that. Uh, as for prizes, uh, what I'm thinking is a, a year of Xbox Live for the winner because I, I do get a discount on that. So I could technically give you a year of Xbox Live. The only problem is, what if you don't have Xbox and you win? What would you do with it? So I'll think about that. Leave me suggestions for prizes in the comment section below. But that's really all that's been going on right now, guys. Not a whole lot. Got my stop motion filming and stuff. Speaking of that, before we go, I also need um, a couple storyboard directors. And if you don't know what a storyboard director is, they're kind of like the people who make the storyline. So if you're really good at storyline and you like editing and making stories and stuff, also send me a message about being a storyboard director because I could really use a couple of those. But now that is all I have going on. I see a couple of actors, storyboard directors, really not much. So yeah, that's what's going on. On Friday, I'll make you guys a video of the army. I'll get filming. I'll show you how I get how I film my stop motions because a lot of you want to know that. So I'll make a video on that too this weekend. So I'll have a couple of videos streaming in this weekend, and I hopefully I can get back on my regular schedule. But anyways, guys, thank you for watching. Please rate, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time.